sandwiches right there. What's going on? Hey, uh, who all in this crowd has seen God heal someone physically? I say that's pretty sweet. You don't see that every Sunday morning. You know what I mean? Maybe you do. I don't know. I hope you do. That'd be pretty sweet. Um, I'm going to dedicate this song to... Who's someone that got healed tonight? <laughs> what happened with Spencer? Spencer had a broken hand. Oh, but no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Spencer had a broken hand, but he doesn't have a broken hand. Tattoos, 
Or maybe in our spirits, we are tattooed like Maori warriors and looking for a fight. And this is what I think. I think God's finding his people within the subculture scenes and within people that have been turned out or passed away and passed out. So here's the thing. This song is dedicated to you. Dedicated, it's one of many that's going to be dedicated to you before you start dedicating them to Jesus. Here's the thing. This song is called No One Leaves This Room Sick. Okay? I'd like to say that it's mostly a healing song. Like it's mostly about physical healing. It's, it's mostly about the fact that I am not alone because Jesus lives on the inside of me. So you guys need to understand this. Your identity dictates your reality. What you believe about yourself, you live out. It doesn't matter how much Christian talk you try to put on top of it. If you believe you're a worthless scumbag, you are going to live like you are a worthless scumbag. If you believe a lie, you will live a lie. Does that make sense? Here's the cool thing about truth. You can't have an opinion about it. Yeah. Does that make sense? You guys have Jesus Christ's spirit on the inside of you. You guys are going to heal the sick and raise the dead and cast out demons and ascend into heavenly places and hang out with Jesus and play poker with him. It's going to be awesome. Here's the thing. You guys are meant to be miracle workers. This song's for you. It's called No One Leaves This Building Sick. And no one will leave this building sick. 